Good evening to you. Sleet and snow forecast for next week. In the meantime, so much colder. Wet and wintry weather to come for some of us. And freezing, frosty, icy nights return as temperatures slide away. Much of the action across southern Britain in the next 24 hours. Rain turning to sleet and snow across Wales and higher ground of southern England. And then we've got another very cold night in store tomorrow night as temperatures fall. A widespread frost, the chance of ice. Rain returns to the south on Sunday for the rest of us clearer and staying so cold. Temperatures so much lower than we've seen in the last couple of days. As for the next few hours, temperatures fall across Scotland and Northern England, widespread frost as well as ice and occasional rain giving some sleety wet snow, particularly across the highest ground. Further south, temperatures so much lower than recent nights and another night, another batch of wet weather, the third night in a row to see extensive and steady rain working its way in from the southwest. And here with the cold air, some sleet and hill snow across Wales into the small hours and very much a split set up tomorrow morning clear crisp but so cold across Scotland and northern England brighter sky but barely above freezing if at all frosty and icy further south a very chilly day wet and increasingly wintry with snow across parts of uh, Wales particularly across the higher ground into the south and north Midlands and higher ground of the home counties a wintry mix all day blustery and wet to the southwest and temperatures so low compared to the last few days so much cold and a bitter biting easterly breeze further north clearer but staying barely above freezing even with that brighter sky a very good evening to you. It's set to remain mild for the time being, a little breezy out there in the next 24 hours with brighter skies and blustery showers as the week wears on. We've got low pressure to the north of us encouraging that westerly breeze and it'll blow in a fair few showers and longer downpours as we approach the weekend. And many of them concentrated across the northern half of Britain, but some making some headway into the southern half of Britain and high pressure doesn't quite get in from the west. So generally a mixed setup as we go into Saturday and Sunday, but temperatures just around or above where you'd expect given the time of year. After a dull damp end of the day across the southeast, clearer skies to end the evening and not too much change tonight. The breeze will tend to ease, no significant mist and fog to speak of, and generally speaking, it's looking like a mild night, not much below 13 or 14 degrees as we head into a new day and crisp blue skies as we go into Friday morning. Beautiful and bright from the word go. Full blown blue skies and sunshine for many of us. Really lovely out there, a cheerful start. And then a little more in the way of cloud as we head through the afternoon. Brisk winds pick up across the northern half of Britain and here blustery showers and longer downpours. Primarily through parts of Scotland, Northern England and Northern Ireland. A bit of a soaking, but in sheltered sunnier spots so much better. Further south, a little more cloud working its way in from the southwest. Some dribs and drabs of rain here, but in the sheltered spots further east, highs of 21 or 22 degrees. The mild air with us for a little while longer yet. Into the weekend, bright skies and blustery showers, most of these across the northern half of Britain and temperatures down just a notch. See you soon. A very good evening to you. We keep the sunny skies for the time being, but all change across the south in the next 24 hours. Expecting to see rain here as we approach the weekend. The first significant wet weather for quite some time while it stays much drier across the north. And it's systems rolling in from Spain and France that'll affect the southern half of Britain as we approach the weekend. Some of the rain quite thundery and heavy tomorrow morning. Further north, always a touch drier and calm. And we've got this huge area of high pressure extending from parts of southern Scandinavia and keeping Scotland, Northern England and Northern Ireland fine and dry in the next 48 hours or so. As for this evening, late and low sunshine before dusk with the days getting a little more drawn out. And tonight under the clear skies, temperatures slide, freezing and frosty through parts of Scotland, otherwise frost free and nowhere near as cold as recent nights. With a little more moisture in the air, some mist and murk forming across parts of Northern England, particularly through the Pennines and the Peak District. And it's further south, we've got a lot of action to come. The rain through the channel, making some headway into Southern coastal counties tomorrow morning. Here heavy with rumbles of thunder to start the new day. The rain working its way into parts of Wales, the Midlands and the South East before breakfast and this rain will be slow to shift through the course of the afternoon. Disappointingly dull and damp but the rain much needed for some of us. And here with the brisk breeze, temperatures a little lower than today. Further north, better and brighter, some lovely sunshine after a cold start. Temperatures recover, but staying quite chilly around those eastern coasts with the breeze. And we keep that split set up into the start of the weekend as well. See you soon.